All right, Mr. Telefero TV, how's everybody doing out there? I want to salute an artist that I actually kind of like. He got a couple bops to meet. Salute the YBN Almighty J out of Texas. The young little YBN crew, I like what they're doing. They got a couple records back in 2018 that sparked my interest. Fun records, nothing too serious. They're not trying to be lyrical miracle. They're just getting their money and kind of staying out the way. Now, if you don't know a lot about YBN Almighty J, you might know him as the guy that to me was in a stage relationship with the what, what do i call her instagram sensation or public figure black china now in my heart of hearts i believe uh why being almighty j paid to be in a relationship with black china for popularity and, and hell maybe it gave him a couple hundred thousand followers and he was on the blog sites or whatever so maybe it worked out for him it is what it is to each his own over the weekend though why being almighty j was in a situation that he was not on the positive end of. He got into an altercation in New York, and this altercation saw YBN lose some jewelry, all right? He got, it looks like what happened is he was with his, his homies, and they got into it with some crew, and th during the initial argument, I mean, argument and altercation, it looked like YBN's crew was was doing decent, right? Getting some, in, getting some licks in or whatever. Then it looks like as... Time kept going on and this altercation kept getting more physical and ship kept getting more violent. It looked like they got outnumbered and it looked like they cornered YBN Almighty J somewhere, got him by himself solo dolo and they beat his ass on the ground, took his chains, reportedly took his wallet and then they took the shoes that he had on. So they was out to get everything valuable. They would have took his damn flash drive if he had one on him with his music on it, right? Like they was out to take anything valuable. They would have took the drawers off his back if they thought that he, they were clean enough, right? They wanted everything Almighty J had in this jump and robbery attempt. Now, I'm going to show you a pretty graphic image right here. If you get queasy at the stomach easily, you might not want to see this right now. Skip forward 15 seconds. Here's a picture of YBN Almighty J after his injuries that he uh, received over the weekend. So you see, he'll be fine, but definitely it was more than just a uh, a quick little wham bam bigger lamb then i take your jury or snatch your chain they got some good ones in on why being almighty j definitely put did some damage to him and i'm pretty sure he's upset but from what i'm told he will be fine and make a full recovery no life-threatening injuries out there for him probably more or less a pride thing take it from me i've won my share of fights i've lost my share of fights i said i tell anybody i'm about 10 10 and 10 i'm about 500 from the field bruh move on for another day all right i'm gonna give you the generic quotes that your mama or your grandma will give you after you get your ass beat life goes on at least you got your, your life all right you could not have your life somebody's dead after a fight and it ain't you all right keep pushing forward you'll get that jewelry back you'll get that money back those are materialistic things i'm trying to help why be in almighty jay's spirit right now because i know he's probably going through it now i told you guys one that he got robbed for his chains one of those chains was a rap a lot chain now for those who don't know who rap what rap a lot is that is jay prince the respected houston ogs that's his group that's his label that's what he got going and y'all already know jay prince is about his respect if you don't know anything else about jay prince the one thing he demands is respect in every situation as a matter of fact he made a book about it all right and called respect now he got word that his youngin YBN Almighty J that he's financially invested in uh, got robbed and, and his jury was taken away from him and that rap a lot chain was taken from away from him so he hit Instagram to deliver a message to anyone who's listening that could help him get his jury back all right he was like look mob ties called to my real street niggas around the world but especially on the east coast in the bronx there's a clown by the name of zay and his crew who want to become famous by bragging about robbing rap industry niggas they recently bragged about robbing the artist ybn almighty j who i'm invested in so he's letting you know now he's financially invested in ybn almighty j i didn't know that before now all right so let's make that clear this is somebody that he has financial investments in. He said they robbed him of his money and his jewelry, including a rap a lot piece. So therefore they have robbed a piece of me. This is a perfect opportunity to execute our unity uh, where we don't allow moment thinkers to muddy the water over the movement. With that being said, the homies in the Bronx, if any of these clowns are y'all families or friends, speak now so we can 
get some understanding. To ignore this is a recipe for disaster. Other than that, it's these clowns versus the realest niggas in every hood around the world. And that's the meaning of mob ties. And he went on to mention some very notable New York figures at Fun Flex, my son, uh, A Boogie with the hoodie, Cardi, Corey Guns, Fred the Godson, you know, uh, Fat Joe, Swizzy, Remy. He put it out there in the atmosphere. If y'all know these clowns that are doing harm to uh, artists for some industry fame and a little bit of money in your pocket, let them know who I am and, and let them know what I do. That's what he's saying. He's like, yo, we build relationships with niggas in hoods. You know, a lot of these artists, when they go to Houston, Houston's such a big mar market for rap right now. A lot of these artists do hit up Jay Prince. I'm not saying those artists specifically, but a lot of artists do hit up Jay Prince for protection. So I think this is Jay Prince in the nicest way possible, in the, you know, the most to try to not self-incriminate himself the best way he can. He put a very nice message out there in the atmosphere. Yo, Zay, if you got my jewelry, if you, if you got uh, some money or whatever from Why Me and Almighty Jay, I need you to get that chain back to me. I don't want no nigga rocking my rap a lot chain. And obviously, Jay Prince knows the street politics of how this shit goes. I'm sure he knows he's going to have to cough up a little bit of bread to get his, his peace back, right? But I'm thinking that's the least of his problems right now. And if you're Zay, whoever you are, I guess... Jay Prince already knows who did this to his youngin. I, if I were you, I'd take the little 10,000, whatever they offer you, get that jury back. Don't be throwing that thing around the hood and, and having all the niggas grease, neck sweat on it. If you know what I know about Jay Prince, all right? That's not the game you want to play. Give that nigga his jury back. Them niggas don't play no games, all right? I'm just leaving it at that because he put a very nice message in the atmosphere. I um, mean, he friendly asked for his jury back for his artist. That's all I'm going to say. Uh, hopefully that uh, <laughs> that jury is returned to its proper owner. All right. And uh, get well soon. Why be an almighty J? He'll be fine. All of his pride is hurt more than anything else. Thank y'all so much for the time. Those put I don't take it for granted. Jay Prince hops into a YB and Almighty J's feud because his rap a lot chain got mixed in his mess and got stolen. And Jay Prince wants his jewelry back immediately. I'm out. I want to salute you, homie, you know, for, for building your own thing and doing your own thing, creating your own platform, your own website. I got one life to live out my dreams, and I'm giving this thing all I got. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I represent the culture. Right now, you're turning up on MrTalaferro.com, shawty.